What up, players? Hey, so I have a free stream alert notification. This is the alert. Primarily, this might be more for Xbox users, but PlayStation, y'all can still use it. I'm going to show you how to set it up. I use stream elements. Pretty sure you can set it up on Streamlabs, but I don't really use it. So you might have to figure that on your own. But it might be the same concept. So this will be on Stream Elements. Pretty simple. Um, work smarter, not harder. I'm going to show you how to do it. Now, if you do like it, you want to uh, send over a couple of bucks. That's cool. Let's uh, go over to Stream Elements. So we are in stream elements. Obviously, you're going to have to log in, create an account if you don't have one. Um, that could be through uh, your Facebook page, YouTube, Twitch, whatever it is that you're using. Once you sign in, go to overlays, go to the alerts, and find any of them. But... This is the one that I've used. And we're going to create an overlay. Again, work smarter, not harder. You can rename it. Xbox Alerts 2022. Go to Overlays. And then we're going to edit. This will be the where you're going to see the alert. Obviously, we haven't set it up yet, but don't change anything here on position. Everything's good there. Go to layers. Go to settings. And tick off which one you want to use it for. Now, I just want to use it for the follower. So we're going to hit the little cog wheel and edit from there. So this is already the one that was set up. We're going to delete that, clear the sound, and you're going to change video. So these are the ones that I have. Obviously, I've already set it up. What basically you would do is click upload, drag your file over and it'll pop up so it should show up here and all you're going to do is hit submit and you're going to see it there now make sure that you have this layout set up you can also change how the alert message is going to show up but i'm going to leave it as default as far as the alert notification or duration I'm going to put it at 15 seconds total we're going to skip to text settings we're going to leave all of this alone so we're going to test it so that we can adjust go to advance and change that to move it up a little, you can see that right there. Boom. We're going to fix that too. Yeah, that's kind of where we want it. You can adjust as you want, but you get the idea. Now you do see the color. I don't like that. You can leave that if you want, but you can change it. Put it as white. And I don't like the pulse, so we're going to leave it as none. Now you see it. It's aligned perfectly, sort of. All right, now we're going to see, we're going to adjust when the text show up. 
And we're going to go to animation. I have the text fading in in the animation in uh, about 2.5 seconds. We'll put this at zero on fade out and you'll see why. And we want it to appear at about three seconds, more or less when the animation happens. And then we want it to fade out at about six and a half seconds. So now save it. Boom, animation, text appears, and then they disappear. Boom, done. That's it, that's all you had to do. And then basically you're gonna do the same, you're gonna copy the overlay, and we're gonna go to OBS. All right, so we're in OBS, that link you copied, we're gonna use a browser. Bring it over here and we can name it Xbox alerts, click OK. It's going to pop up and paste that link right there. Your canvas size, which is this part right here. And the actual alerts is 1920 by 1080. Click OK. It's basically going to show up here in the middle. We test it. Boom. So you can drag it down. Put it right here on the bottom. So it looks like an actual Xbox alert. Fancy. Noise. Test it. You don't want it there, I mean, you can move it anywhere, right? Yeah, anywhere. That's pretty much it. Let me know what you guys think. If you like it, dislike it. Um, thank you very much. And uh, I'll try to help as much as I can, but uh, it's fairly simple. Let me know what you, let me know what you guys think. Peace out, guys.